When we had last left the Arisen, their adventures brought them once more into contact with the elf archer lord who they had encountered not long ago and gifted a human-made bow to. Indeed, they had set forth on and about their archery trials. However, things took a turn for the worse. Indeed, their sister was captured by some sort of ogre, and using the bow provided, they were able to free her, and thanks to the Arisen's aid, they were able to slay the ogre and keep sister safe and, and well. And so... Uh, they found a new friend, and um, and as well, they were welcomed by the elven kind at the arbor nearby in the woodland to the north, kind of west. Uh, and it was there that they learned some supermeister archery teachings, as well as all manner of other cool quests, like uh, finding some kind of weird junk to throw on a big tree. That would be pretty cool if they managed to do that. Now, however... They would turn their eyes back, back to Vermund, or Vernsworth. <laughs> this is Dragon's Dogma 2. Welcome back. And, as you can see, we have re-outfitted everyone. Uh, I got rid of my cloak. I just didn't quite like it. I really love the, the look of having, even though it's not perfect, I love seeing it connected like that. It's really cool. I like it. Uh, also, Gordon is set up. Uh, in a different way as well. Let's see here. Gordon also received a really cool mace, which I would love to use on Gordon. However, it does like 400 something damage, like 420, 430, right? Which I appreciate the gesture. However, I don't yet want to skip ahead. I don't want Gordon to have like such a big leap in quality gear, right? Because we're not really fighting creatures of that ilk just yet. So, for the time being, Gordon is still using his old trusty broadsword. Uh, when it gets to the point that, at least either on myself or Gordon, we come into contact with weapons that crack the 400 strength or magic rating, uh, I'll swap it back in, right? I think that's a good concession to make. But for the time being, that's too much of a jump, because I myself am only at 302, right? And, of course, uh, we swapped out some of our other equipment here. Yeah, I bought uh, the Nightfall Greaves from the Elf Vendor Lord. Uh, got the Ring of Triumph and Aggression. Gordon's got Resiliency and Vehemence. As well as the Linen Cloak, which I do just prefer the look of. I'm thinking we, we like, shrink part of Gordon's chest or whatever in such a way. That way it drapes a little bit better. Right? Uh, got the same leg plates and whatnot going on all around there. All right. Let us, I think, be off back to the town, right? We don't have anything that looks like it's timed. Yeah. Okay. We shall head on back. I think we got everything dealt with. Are you? I think well, we've spoken with everyone of import here. I want to say, I think, yeah, I think so. Let me just check the other side of this. Yeah, we can't go underneath there. Okay. Yeah, I think we're good. Ingredients are plentiful. How far off is it, though? Should I warp back? I think I should. We're like half the world away, right? We should use a stone. There we are. Good. Got that going. And let's head on back over here to Vernworth. There we are. Thereabouts. Cool. Oh, that took nary a moment. Now that we're here, what did you have in mind, Arisen? Okay, I'm thinking we check back in. Can we find Sven, maybe? And check in with that kid? Anybody here have anything to say? I was. You scarce saw any beastrums here in Vernworth. But that's changed in recent years. 
You'd think that'd be on account of immigration, but not so. See, a child born of both races always favors the Beastron. Really? At least I've ne'er beheld a human with a Beastron parent. Well, I suppose it might be possible, but tis unheard of. Huh. If we keep mixing, someday our kingdom will end up with more Beastrons than they've got or in Batal. This ladder can oh take my us God. to new heights. Oh Have my God! Discoveries await us above. His his fucking dialogue is like classic, uh, like like a a crypto fascist, right? He's he's like a he's like a crypto bigot, right? He's he hasn't outright said that he hates Beastrin or anything like that, but the fact that he mentions it in the the words in which he uses, I feel is super telling. Right? I don't know. Maybe it's a lot more matter of fact, and more we could learn more of this. But holy shit, what what a thing right. to say! Just follow me. Right? I I wonder if they know that because I feel like that's like like is that something that people are aware of in in Japan? Like, is this kind of discourse active there? I I don't know. All right, what's up with you? Oh, thank you. What about you all? I fear I've not useful to share. Okay. And you? Good day, sir. Good day. What of you? I've got nothing for ye. Okay. Sure. Let us head over here. Right? Okay. Hey, there's Sven. What's You're up? Already a Hi. Faring well, I hope. Would you care to join me? I'd not say no to a bit of company. Well, sure. I was hoping you'd say that. Do you know, I had a feeling we'd meet here today. Intuition, I suppose. Say, you're not from round here, are you? Are you a traveler? Have you seen many places? I'm not really sure where I'm from, honestly. I'm, I mean, I, I don't think I'm from here, but I don't know where I'm from. How I envy you. This city is all I know. I long to learn more of the outside world, but Mother won't allow it. She's always telling me how dangerous it is beyond the palace walls. But that only makes me question her judgment all the more. After all, if the world truly is so perilous, what of the lives of our people? They must be fraught with uncertainty, subject to harsh conditions. It seems unfair that I alone should be shielded from that reality. But listen to me waffling on. Ah, I almost forgot. I, I happened upon this little curio the other day. Here, you're welcome to it if you'd like. My apologies, friend. But Ring of I'd a best cruel. Be going. I mustn't let Mother find out I left the palace. Thank you for indulging me. I, I do hope we'll see each other anon. Till then, farewell. He really seems. Inspired by fucking Timothy uh -huh. Chalamet, right? Is something <laughs> he seems like he could pass for like a like a, a sibling. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Let's check what this ring does. Ah, oh, slightly increases our carry weight. Well, how much is slightly? Five units, I think. Based on the other one. Let's see. Or no, status, max encumbrance, 40.7, right? And then let's equip this. Put it in the right hand. Status, yeah, five. Okay. I don't know if it's worth it, right? Not over the strength enhancement, huh? Which our strength is currently 302. And then with this ring... It becomes 332. So it's a 10% buff. Huh. Roughly. Roughly 10%. Right? And the encumbrance buff is just shy of 10% too. Hmm. 
Okay. Well, I'm not sure. Even if it shouldn't, I would greatly appreciate a coin or two to Guess we need to come here at night or whatever, right, for this guy? Let's see, quests. Oh. Well, looks like we're meant to meet back with Sven again. Okay. We could go keep an eye on the beggar if we wanted. Right, or we could... Go report to Captain Brandt. Yeah, let's go do that real fast. Now, listen close, as today I shall tell of a serpent with powers most fell. What? Our hero ventured into a shrine long enclosed, whereupon he found serpent and soldiers in battle opposed. Though to the soldiers' aid he would fain have leapt, unease overtook him, so behind a pillar he crept. And not a moment too soon, for there came a flash of light, ere the room filled with screams, soldiers wailing at their plight. Then the shrine grew deathly still, and our hero was all alone, for every last soldier had been transformed into stone. Oh, a Medusa, like from the, the start. The presence of might, the man crept up to the pillar upon which it was entwined. Seeing his moment, he unsheathed his blade and brought the pillar low in a thundering cascade. The gloating serpent was caught by surprise, and with a pitiful hiss, neath the pillar it writhed. <laughs> Till mustering swiftly the last of its might, to the depths of the shrine did the monster take flight. Thus, with a wit as sharp as his sword was honed, did our hero put an end to the threat imposed. And who was our hero? Why, needless to oh say. Oh my gosh. It was the father of House Berkeley, which lives on to this day. It's got to be the House Berkeley folks, right? That's got to be it where he gets his money. Right? They're like paying him for propaganda or whatever. <laughs> Hold up. I bet we can solve this. Didn't it show up on the map when we were looking through this? Berkeley. Huh. Shit, maybe not. Yeah, maybe I'm tripping balls. Unless they're like the comptroller. I guess that's possible. We still haven't been to some of these places, like Mildred's Dwelling. And I would like to go to them. It's just a lot to do. Okay. Sure. While we're here, shall we take care of that other task we were entrusted with as well? When the mind is split, the heart must leave. Or so I've learned. Oh, is Sven ready again already? Who is this? Oh, sorry, Hoffman. I don't see Sven here anymore. Okay, you know what? Yeah, let's go check out this other thing because we may need to come back at night and, like, follow him to the Berkeley house or whatever. Okay. Oh, sorry. Didn't see you all. Okay. Head over here to the inn. Can I get up here? I think I'd been up here before. Oh, God. Yeah. Chess has been opened. Okay. Oh. What's going on over here? Hey, old friend. Have you a spare moment? Uh, sort of. I have an eye for people. Oh, Mildred. And my instincts tell me you're of trustworthy ilk. I'm in a bit of a quandary, you see. I'm to be gone for a week with no one slated to mind the house in my stead. Fear not. I only ask your name to list as a tenant. 
You needn't bother yourself with the cleaning, and I don't expect you to stay cooped up in there, neither. I'd be much obliged if you'd simply consider my home a waypoint on your travels. Sound appealing? Then come on by and have a look-see. I've taken the liberty of marking the location on your map. Mildred, this is such a wild thing to do. You don't even know me. I, I guess we're doing it. <laughs> okay. This is such a wild thing to, to even consider doing with a stranger. Good thing I'm here, really. I know just where to go. It was an eventful journey. <laughs> You've come. Glad to see you, friend. So, what say you? Would you care to live here in my absence? As I've said, you needn't worry about tending to the place. Oh, okay. Many thanks, friend. I guess we have I a free I in. Count on you. I'll stop by again in a week's time. Or maybe Until not. Then, farewell. Can we sleep here? I'm all for camping, but occupy for a week. A joy that can't be beat, and ask for a full week at no charge. What a steal! Huh. That's just what I was thinking. Oh. Storage for real. And then, yeah, we can sleep here. Wow, okay. Shit. Wow, well, fuck the inn, then. Free place to stay for a week. Okay. Do you think this runs on, like, Morrowind rules? If we... <laughs> If we uh, kill her when she comes back, we get to keep the house. <laughs> Maybe she never comes back, right? What if that actually legitimately if she never comes back? Okay. Let's see. Uh, maybe we all go back up here. Let's search for the captain. Let's see. Monster calling. That's what we needed. Okay. Is he in here? He might only be here during the night. How do we get to... Is there an upper floor here? Welcome. Hmm. There's a back room. Oh, shit. Sorry. Oh, we've been back here. Huh. I mean, maybe he's at, like, the, the guard captain's place? Or at the guard house? That would make more sense. If we go Take over there around. and he's Take hanging out. Treat your ears to a tail bite. Yeah, right up here somewhere. Oh, what's going on? Is there something going on here? Or is it just people chilling? I think it's just people chilling. Good day, hey. sir. Good day. You don't need a permit to get into Batal. Just hide in the back of an ox cart, aye? It works. Mind, you've got to avoid the guard's line of sight. Huh. But it's easy enough. I should know. I've done it. That's really good to know. We're not allowed to talk to your mission, sir. You're on a mission. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Hey, thought I'd find you here. Matter. Shall we see where it leads? Time is of the essence. We must needs expose Deesa's plots ere Deesa. they can come to fruition. Oh, well, um, I thought I'd done it. Do I need to Wait until night as well? When you're off work? Oh. Mind, I have time for a citizen in need. I think I remember you, Franz. I trust Alt's well, sir. Yeah, they were out there at uh, Harv, the city. Or the little town. Okay, well, let's open this. Fluted bow. Compares to a real bow. Can't you see I'm on duty? 
Yeah, same goes for you. Okay. Well, I guess we can just pass time until evening then. We have so many quests waiting on it. Just doze off. Okay. Did we change time of day? I think so. All right. I guess if this... If this dude is here... Oh, he's not. He straight up left. I've no words left for you or any... Huh. Where'd he gone? Let's see. Don't think you're safe just because you're in the city. Monsters have gotten bolder of late and more ferocious. One found its way inside the common quarter just the other night. Much blood was spilled afore the thing was cold. You could say it was an ill twist of fortune. But mayhap we ought to be better prepared for such incidents. I wonder if building a nice high wall is out of the question. Hmm. Okay. Wow, yeah, I have no idea where this guy went off to. Oh wait, look! He's showing up on our map, I think. Okay. Yeah, look at that. Or is that for Mildred's place? I'd fade oh. you speak on any subject, friend. Uh, okay. M might I beg a favor of you? Sure, what's up? You have made quite a difference in my life, you know. Since meeting you, I have braved innumerable tests of courage and learned much of myself in the world. As a testament to this, I intend to set out on a journey anon, and I am hoping you might accompany me. T'would be a chance for me to show you just how far my skill with the bow has come. Okay. Sure. Are you, like, smitten with me? Are you, like, constantly blushing and smiling now? Many thanks. Sure. I mean, I'll do the quest. Fuck, it's out here? Jesus, man. I don't think I've, I've never been out that way. Accompany your visitor on a pleasant jaunt. Okay. A pleasant jaunt? Is it really? Okay. Oh, shit. Yeah, where it where is our quest even? Huh. Whoa, okay. Huh. Well, that's wild. Being by your side is an honor and a joy. Okay. Well. Are we really meant to go all the way out there with this dude? Because that's fucking wild. Okay. Well, fuck it. Let's, let's fucking do it, I guess. Okay. Almost time to set out. Hmm. I've things to do, if you don't mind. Alright. I mean, I guess we could go over to... the ox cart and take a ride and see how far that gets us out. Right. We could try that. Let's see. A white ox cart. Or are we meant to, like, walk with them, for real? Ox carts make for relatively safer travel. They can be most convenient, though they only travel during the day. He's still here? I don't know that he is. Okay. Well, I don't see him. Maybe I'm just supposed to meet him out there now. Oxcarts bound for the checkpoint rest town. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Okay. Here, 200 big ones. Oh, yeah. 
Good. I don't know where the checkpoint rest town is, but, uh, sure. Let's doze off and find out where we end up. Worst case, we just use a fairy stone, right? Oh, fuck. The song here is tripe with lightning on your side. I shan't let the palm you. Most impressive, master. People like that will be done here soon enough. What a resounding success. Oh my gosh. Oh shit, when failed Tyler's travel companion. Oh dear. Oh my god. So did his ass die? Well, what the fuck? Let's check our quest here. Huh. Yeah, weird. Okay, I don't- I don't know. Where are we? We're not that far from town anymore. Right? Shit. Okay. Well, we learned something. Let's run back to town, I think. Goblins approach! Uh oh. Minotaur. Torrent shot. Nice. Okay, torrent shot is pretty good. Yeah, feeling like that's pretty good damage. Another ox cart. Oh, this is the regal one that we heard about. Come to think of it, our rights have gone unchanged for a while now. That explains the harmony betwixt us. I'm not taking any passengers just now, sir. Huh. Yeah, this is the really fancy one we heard about. I'm not taking any. What? Okay. You looking for a But the VIP passenger isn't here. What do you want? Huh. Okay, well let's be on our way. We found here of all places. They are endearing creatures. Compared That's quite a large boulder, but me thinks twill budge if we combine our strength. Shall we set it rolling? <laughs> Ha! They 
are right to fear us. Tis a wonder any foe challenges us with the Arisen in our midst. All right, that went pretty well. Yeah, I'm liking this setup a lot. For an arch. Shit. I shan't allow any further harm to come to you. I grant you life, Miss Fangs. Damn, Gordon, you sent that thing flying. Look at these little lights accompanying us. Oh, shit. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. I say we collect as much as we can carry. Damn, is that dude almost dead? I think you're good, okay. We have found a material. Different combinations of materials result in different creations. Let's see, we'll try to get back to town before... before it's too late. Or too early. Right. That way we can chat with Sir Brant. Look, Master! Goblins! At least we know this, like I said, for future reference. Right? It seemed as if we were on some beloved situation right there. With, uh, Gwen Lader, whatever their name is. <laughs> uh, and I'm not really interested in them, right? But it'll be useful for when we potentially want to chest lies have a close. beloved, right? I can divine no way to reach it. Oh, way up there. Okay, what route ought we take here? Looks like this one. Oh. There we go. God. Whoa, what the fuck is that noise? I've got a good feeling about this one. Let my magic grant you an elemental boost. Look at that fall damage that took. Jesus, Gordon. That's pretty good. Oh, look at the little pier down there. Very nice. I'm surprised the city doesn't have more of a, like, harbor, right? Oh, because the brine! That's why. Right? We know why it wouldn't have more of a harbor, because ships can't sail forth into the the open seas because of the brine. So there's no need for a harbor. Oh my gosh, they thought of everything. Okay. Looks like Come we made it in time, it. I think. Was there not another task we were to see to somewhere nearby? Receive we'll recompense from Sven a few days' time. As to whether it will be sooner or later, that is for the Arisen to decide. Okay, let's check here now. Monster culling. Good. Okay. Is this guy not out here anymore? This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. After you, Arisen. Yeah, I don't really know how to track him down. I guess this is what um, we had heard about when other pawns would say, like, oh, I've heard that the other Arisen I was with had many coming and going from their their home or whatever, right? Okay. Hey there. Greetings, your majesty. Have you a moment to speak? 
I do. Dude, the fur on this bow is really wild. Though I think it's plants, right? Is what we read. There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Okay. Tell me of monster culling. You've done a fine job culling those monsters, your majesty. Tis common knowledge among the people that t'was you who delivered them from danger. The number of those who seek out this tavern in the hope of an audience with the Arisen grows by the day. Really? This tavern? Should you continue to display such valor, the day will soon come when Disa can no longer deny your presence. And ere it slips my mind. Pray, take this. Tis a symbol of my own gratitude. And with that, our task oh. is done. A cloak. Expeditioner's Indeed. Cloak. You've culled more than your fair share of monsters. I expect tales of your valor will soon be told in taverns. Really? I like that. <laughs> Thank you, Amethyst. Okay. Well. What does this cloak do and look like? Oh, it looks pretty fun. Okay. It gives one slash, strike, and knockdown resist. Eh. It's okay. Hmm. Let's see if I prefer it, right? It's not too horrible. There is much we ought to tend to, if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Okay. Let's see. Tell me of the Queen Regent. We'll just go down this. You will need to infiltrate the palace to gather evidence of Deezer's misdeeds. I hesitate to ask something so dangerous of you. Yet I fear we have few other options. Okay. I have attempted to do the same through my own channels before now. Though... I have yet to uncover so much as a whisper of her plots. Would that I could undertake the task myself, but my station prohibits me from reckless action. What say you, your majesty? Might I ask this task of you? Sure. Uh, I might need to swap to a thief, though, and pick up the stealth ability, <laughs> it sounds like. I shall ensure that the door to the Queen Regent's office is open between midnight and dawn. Pray use that time to conduct your investigation. Over here. Okay. Sure. Let us head over to the vocation place, huh? What's this say? Has this always been here? Fresh fruits for sale. Get them while they're here. Shipments like these are few and far between. Okay. Someone is looking this way. Oh, what? Is there aught about me that caught their eye? This person? What? I see life as a journey. To oh shit, to no, this person. Time. Okay. Huh. Am I meant to catch you? Yeah. Okay. My, my. I'm trapped like a rat in a cage. <laughs> Despite all your rage. And flee. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Why are you following me? What? Can't you think of a reason? I'd thought you were keener wit than that. Let's just say there are some who don't want you wandering about as you please. I was to report on your comings and goings, you see. But I suppose that job's over. Now you found me out? So, how about it, friend? Will you let me go? I've no reason to trouble you any further. Refuse or demand compensation? I demand compensation. Aye, aye. You'll have your coin. That's how this works, isn't it? 
Do I want gold? No, I don't want gold. Greed will get you nowhere, friend. But worry not. You won't need it where you're headed. Oh, let shit! Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. I shan't let them harm me. What in the fuck? Oh, I can revive him. Huh. Should I revive him? What will happen if I revive this guy? Fuck it, let's find out. I'll, I'll waste a wake stone on this to see if anything weird happens. It'll be funny if he just attacks me immediately. You there! Halt! Brant? Shit! We're in for it now! Bermudo? With all likelihood, he is an agent dispatched from Batal. Pray, let us handle the rest. We will hear all from he has Batal. To say before the week is out. I bid you, wait till then. Oh shit, y'all got him. Oh my god, there is actually something that happens. How bold you are in irons. Do not test me. It'll do you no good letting me rot in here, you know. Another agent will be on you before long. Oh shit. What the fuck? Oh, that's so cool. Oh my gosh, I took such a risk that anything at all would even happen there. Okay, well that was fucking wild. Let's see, what all have we got? Return to Captain Brant and hear the findings of- oh, wait a few days, Deesa's plot. Search for evidence, right, we can do that. We have to go to the castle, which we haven't even been to the nobles area, have we? Okay. Yeah, we better run up real quick to Perhaps new discoveries await us above. Oh wait, are you the beggar guy? No. I'm assuming he didn't change his clothes or whatever, right? That'd be a little wild. Have you business with the guild, sir? I should I do. be glad to assist you. Do I have new skills to acquire, by the way? No. Let's change my vocation around. Back to thief. Go to equipment. Good. My hat doesn't come over with me. That's fine. Okay. Sure. Do I have tokens? No, I don't have any. Okay. Do come again. Oh, I cannot wait to see your nimble blood. Have you business with the guild, oh, hang sir? On. Let's see. I should be glad to assist you. Our augments may need filling out, yeah. Okay. As well, we have poise. Reduces stamina when struggling in a foe's grip. Oh, right. Okay. Should we buy poise when struggling in a foe's grip? I mean, I guess. It's pretty cheap. It'll at least give us something. Okay. Let's head up here. Swap out our items real fast. Oh, we also need to swap in our um Good evening, sir. I trust you. What do you call it? Right? Our ability. Oh, let's deposit these. Oh. Forgot. We are actually full up on goblin horn, so we just need to sell them. It on the okay. road, despite. And then let's get our new daggers out. The cool. hour. Much obliged. And then equipment. Equip those. Good. Oh, man. 
Valencia. Yeah, I really don't like the cloak. I don't know. It's not doing it for me. It'd be so much better if I had plate armor, but I do not. Okay, and then... Have you business with the guild, sir? I should be Let's change around our skills here. Huh. How about we change out ignited blades for smoke screen? And what does the advanced version do? Oh, it's not smoke screen. I'm looking for shadow cloak. There we are. Smoke screen throws out a blind effect, which may also be good. Hmm. Okay. An advanced form of shadow cloak that renders the user even more difficult. Decreased cost of stamina. More difficult for hostile targets to detect at a decreased cost of stamina. Yeah, let's do it. Costs even less stamina. Glad to assist you. Always a pleasure. Okay, Shadow Veil. Good. Okay. And let's check our map. Yeah, fuck. We haven't even been to this place. Okay. Let's see about it. Can turn on our lantern, though. We're not sneaking in just yet. Okay. Good. I'm assuming you can do this even without being a thief, right? But I wonder if, if it even helps being a thief for it. Only person I believe in is myself. Ingredients okay. what do you want? Just checking in, Victoria. Got some sun bloom. Okay. Oh, restricted entry. There are some locations that are entirely off limits, and others which you will only be permitted entry at once at specific times of day. For instance, if a guard catches you on the palace grounds at night, you will be apprehended and thrown in jail for trespassing. There are also certain locations that forbid pawns from entering the premises altogether. Masquerades are regularly held at Vernworth Castle's Masquerade Hall and may afford you an opportunity to make the acquaintance of important individuals. However, masquerades are formal occasions, and you will only be permitted if you to attend if you are wearing suitable attire. Let's go off with oh, your own. shit. You are the Arisen, yes? Oh. The captain gave me your description. Follow me! Oh. You're smuggling me in. Okay, then. Better turn off the lantern just in case. Alright, where are we going? We going straight to the door? Looks like we're incredibly close. It is best you move along. Should one of the other guards spy you? I will be forced to play my part. Pray be cautious, your majesty. Okay. Thank you. Oh, sneaky time music. <laughs> wow, listen to this. Okay. Oh, Marcher's outfit. Okay. Well, is this going to be a disguise? Sure looks it. Okay. So it's there we are. If I play it cool, am, am I fine to just walk around? What's this here? 
Writings of a soldier on duty. I cannot help but think it's strange. Pawns used to loiter about the Riftstone in droves, but I've not seen a single one for some time now. Tis difficult to imagine where they might have gone. I wonder if this bears reporting. Oh, really? Mayhap I really would have been better off a baker. Okay, well, we probably shouldn't go that way. There's a guy right there. Okay, looks like lantern oil. Get some of that. Okay. Cool. Guessing I need go upstairs, right? Let's see how this works. We don't have... Yeah, none of our pawns are with us at present. Which is quite fine. That's, uh... There was some... There, it works similarly in the original game. Whenever you went into the... Like... Duke's palace or whatever. The Ducal Palace. Seems to be the room. Okay. Torn letter. Who's there? Oh, Sven. Uh, it's just me. Just the, the, the marcher marching around, making sure there's no troublemakers. Pray, keep your voice low. Wouldn't be good for either of us if someone was summoned to come check on me. Could it be that you have come to bring Mother's schemes to light? Wait, do you recognize me? I, Disa is my mother. Pray forgive me for not telling you sooner. Wow, okay, this is definitely reactivity. If we hadn't met with him first, would we have even gotten this? It was never my intent to deceive you. I simply feared that if I spoke the truth, none would wish to involve themselves with me. But that is no longer a concern. Tis clear that we are allied in purpose. My word! You mean to say that you are the true Arisen? That the Sovereign currently residing in the palace is a pretender? Could Mother have had a hand in that as well? Regent Kin Sven appears uh -oh. missing from Joel. The have you seen him? God, he's about to make some wild shit happen in Helldivers 2. Me? No, sir. Then start searching, you fool. Should aught befall the Regent Kin, tis us who'll answer to her grace. The Regent Kin. Forgive me. My absence seems to have made this rather more difficult for us. You ought leave the palace at once. This room turned up little of interest, but I've a mind to look into this further. I shall send word to Captain Brandt if I discover aught you should know. Yo, Sven, you're gonna help with this? Damn! You're cool as shit! I'll head out first and speak with the Sentinels. Use that opportunity to make good your escape. Oh. Okay. Then I'll make like a cat and jump out the fucking window, baby. Anything else here? Forgive me. I couldn't sleep. I thought a stroll might clear my head. Prithee inform us when you leave your chambers. If aught were to happen to you. Let's overhear this. Oh, I think that was it. Okay. Oh. Oi. Okay. <laughs> this rocks. Okay. Uh, let's see. We jump down here? Yeah. This is legit just like a better version of some of the stuff you get up to in the, the original game. I don't know if I'm actually under disguise or if it was just Sven who recognized me. Maybe, like, maybe I smell really weird. I smell like a cat or something. And he knew it was me. Okay. There we are. <laughs> Good. Oh, there's our pawns chilling out here. I'll admit, I did worry you'd forgotten me. Oh, I'd never forget y'all. We make too good of a team. Let's change around our equipment once more. Look, we didn't even need our our usual fare. Our um, 
sneaking stuff. Oh, whoa. Raise visor? Oh my god, you can walk around with a visor up? That's fucking rad! Holy shit. Okay. Well, good. What's this? Come to admire my sculptures, have you? Um... <laughs> yeah, Clark, of course, I heard all about him. Oh, oh, to think my eminence as a collector would reach in the ears of the Arisen. If only my collection were complete, I'd fain allow you to inspect it. Well, maybe I can help with that collection being complete. Alas, the sculpture that I commissioned to be its centerpiece is yet to arrive. Oh. And would wound my pride to have you behold my collection ere it is made whole. If your curiosity shall not be denied, however, mayhap you'd consider paying a visit to the sculptor in my stead. Sure, where where are they? The man's home is located in Bak Batal. Whoa, you in need Batal? Only tell him that I eagerly await the sculpture's completion. I say we speak with anyone and everyone who springs to mind. You never know what sort of useful tidbits we might turn up. Right, I agree, Gordon. Okay. Actually, Gordon, do you want this hat? Or no, we can probably find Look, you a better master, one that actually provides chest. real armor. We shall have to find a way to reach it. Uh, sit up there. Am I allowed here? I, th I think so. I don't think this area is restricted. Oh, what the hell? It's on top of this building? Oh, good God, Gordon. How'd you even see it? I know you're quite tall, but <laughs> able to spy even that? Good God, man. Oh, this is the comptroller's Isn't it about hand. about time we had ourselves a meal? Oh, what I wouldn't give for a bowl of hot stew. Oh, look at this, a big sack. A courtly tunic. Oh, is this what we're going to need? Didn't we just hear about how we need to be appropriately dressed? We had seen some of these for sale. Can we get like a five finger discount by robbing this motherfucker? A hide cape? Can I get more, like, a courtly pant? A courtly trowel? Oh my gosh, I can. Wow. I know the wide fit is in these days. But I prefer the more timeless, straight, or slim. Ring of deflection. Great if we get accused of anything. Oh my gosh. Are these people dead? Are they dead or do they just sleep like they're dead? Oh, they're just... Okay, there's, they just sleep as if they've died. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Are they dead? Okay, great. Fucking awesome. Uh, let's see. What does that ring do? Oh, what does this cape do? Meh. Reduces damage taken from slash attacks. Oh, deflect. I see. Oh, it all makes sense now. Ah, another treasure. I don't think there's a hat associated with this. Soothing and salubrious. Okay. What an asshole. Okay. Oh, shit. Let's turn off our lantern there. And we shall speak with Brant, I think. Can I actually check that item we had taken? Torn letter. Yeah. A fragment of a letter that was torn to shreds. You can just make out the crest of Batal in the name Disa. Best you showed this to Captain Brandt. Fast! I can hardly keep you in my sights, Arisen! No time to catch your breath! Try to keep up! Alright. Let's check over here. Ugh! 
Hey, Brant. Had to take the shortcut there before you went to work. There is much we ought to tend to if we are to strengthen your majesty's claim as a true arisen. Okay. Tell me of the captured agent. We will hear all he has to say before the week is out. I bid you, wait till then. Is there aught else you would speak of, your majesty? There is. Um... Tell me of the Queen Regent. How fared your mission? Was there aught suspicious to be found in the Queen Regent's office? Yeah, there was this torn letter from Batal. This scrap. It was part of a letter. And from Batal, no less. This alone can prove little, but tis clear that Deezer's schemes run deep. To think, Deezer's actions have weighed even on the mind of her own son. I think what's really wild about the lack of lip syncing, like I do kind of appreciate that they scarcely tried whatsoever, right? That's charming in its own way. But what makes it really wild is how incredible the characters just look, right? Like how realistic and like incredible every single character has seemingly looked uh, that we've ever come into contact with, right? Least of all uh, Brant here, you know? Like, they even got um, that thing that, that people uh, talk about every so often, how how when, when you have actors and actresses with, like, darker skin, you need, like, a particular type of uh, lighting and makeup in order to make them sort of, like, appear better on screen, right? Because a lot of, like, lighting and makeup is made for people with, people with like, lighter complexions, lighter skin tones. Right, so you need to like go into a different sort of uh, I don't know, not expertise, but you you need to. There's a different way about in which you go about it, right? You can't just sort of apply the same lessons, right? So I so I've always heard from when people discuss this in like you know television and movies, right? Uh, that kind of lighting and makeup work, right? And I feel like Brandt has got it going on here right now. Right? I'm not even on maxed out settings and everything, right? Like, what what is being accomplished here is is really pretty wild, I feel. It is a surprise, but a welcome one. Deza is a, the doting mother before the Regent King. If Regent King Sven is willing to aid us by drawing Deza's focus, we may be able to gain here more useful information. You have done well, Your Majesty. Though I am limited in the aid I am able to offer, I bid you, take this. It seems oh, we wow. right Full to wake stone. Queen Regent. We ought to keep an eye on her in the days to come. How very peculiar. Okay. Phasus. Now there's a name to remember. Phasus. Okay. A case of Sculptor's Block, Risen Shadow. Huh. Can we really track down this beggar for some reason? Yeah, I don't know where he's gone. I mean, I guess we could, like, run through the slums area real quick. Right? I mean, that's... That's possible. I was hoping there would be like a Berkeley estate. Because that would be like our biggest hint. Hmm. Or maybe the common quarter? I don't know. Yeah, no other houses other than Mildred's show up here. Okay. Tis a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? Ah, oh, excellent find. Let's see. Like, I'm assuming if this guy is considered a beggar, we should check the slums. Right? That may be presumptive, though. Oh. 
grateful and you're equipped. Who are you? I can't solve all your problems, you know. Oh, I didn't ask you to. I will see to it that the law is upheld. Oh, okay. What have we here? Is there aught? No. See, I feel like if they're being paid by some, like, noble family or whatever to propagandize their name, we probably ought go to, like, the noble quarter, you know? Hmm. But I'm not sure how we can get him to leave after he shows up, you know? Okay. Let's head over here and swap back to Archer, I think. That way we can get that completed and filled out, I think. Down this way. And... Let's see. Is it this? Yeah. Good. So let's swap back to Archer. I should be glad to assist you. Unless, is there, is there like an augment I really, really want? Augments your strength. I mean, that is good. That is actually really good. How about here? Increased damage when striking a target's vitals. That's really good, too. Enables you to clamber up cliffs and scale foes and other surfaces more quickly. That's wild that that's an archer one. I mean, I guess clamber up cliffs. Sure. But yeah, we definitely could value, or could find value in that. Swap back to archer. Good. Okay, and we got the hat. Lovely. Always a pleasure. Just think. The first our foes shall see of you will be an arrow in their breasts. Upon my life, no foe shall approach the Arisen. Okay, let's swap well, out our then, equipment you again. Will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey when treated to the foremost hospitality in all Vernworth. Okay, and then we need to deposit that. We can also deposit these, like, little disguises and whatnot. Though they are quite lightweight. Okay, I'll even deposit the Ring of Accrual. Okay, and I think we're good. And let's withdraw a bow. A good one. There. You know where to find me. Okay, and then we'll re-equip it real quick. There we are. Lovely. Okay. Hmm. Oh! Sven is back out here. As is our mystery beggar. Hoi, friend! Have any time for me today? I dare say we're owed you another talk. Okay, already. I'm I'm down for it. There's something I've come to understand during my stolen hours exploring these streets, and I wanted to share it with you. Okay. Every last resident in this city is wholeheartedly devoted to living out their lives. It seems a simple observation, I know, but to me, it was a revelation. What the fuck are you talking about? For it made me painfully aware of my own position. Can this existence of mine even be called living when I am so doted upon by my mother? Okay. <laughs> okay, a part of this is just us having to put up with, you know, the sort of stereotypical experiences of what sounds like someone in their waning teenage years. I want to live a life I can proudly call my own and to achieve it with all that my heart desires. I tire of enduring my mother's coddling and of having to mind every twitch in her face in order to appease her. Looking at this box, it 
fills me with courage. The box does? Tis proof that I am not my mother's servant to be willed about as she pleases. Tis something I obtained of my own will. Though it came to me through you, of course. Pray, take this with <laughs> yeah, my thanks. You obtained it of your own will through me. a rarity, as I hear it. I hope tis to your liking. Now, I'd best be off. Oh, fairy stone. Wow. I may not be able to wander the city again for some time. There's aught I would do. Thus, I cannot say when next we'll see each other. Though, I feel sure we shall in time. Uh, perhaps sooner than we might think. <laughs> Till then, take care, friend. Okay. That was quite a gift. I hope that procuring it was not a burden upon the lad. You have my support. Right. Yeah, if I had to guess, I'd say like late teens, early 20s. Okay. Can we get a new hat for Gordon here? I know they sell some. Welcome to Bjorn's Armory. And quality is what you need if yep. you want to Yeah, quality is what Gordon needs. Oh, this hat's only for a warrior. Okay. This one isn't quite as good. But it doesn't have that shit in the back that may cause him some degree of consternation. Do we value that? Do we value it over... Do we value fashion over functionality? I think we ought. And look at this. This as well actually goes way better. This general's mantle. Holy hell, it's actually way far better. It's like a full set, right? See the trim? It matches the helmet and the, the boots. Yeah, this is actually what we should get, not the hat. Holy hell. There you go, Gordon. Have that. So if all you check the price, just remember, misers die early deaths. Okay, is there aught I can do here with our bow? There is. But should I? Maybe I should do some upgrades on my... Greaves. Yeah, that may be better. Miasmite. Black crystal? What the fuck? Okay, let's upgrade the bow. Dappled ore. Next time we see that ore vendor, we probably should buy them out now. Many At least as best we can. I appreciate the business. Our packs are heavier, and our purse is far lighter. I like the way in which money seems to actually have like purpose and value Spend here. So you know, freely offers a unique sort of joy. Well, let's keep our noses to the gro well met, sir. Do you have anything new? No. How might I be of sir? Do come again. Uh, should we check the alchemy lord? I've heard that sometimes well vendors will restock high value items like fairy stones. Need anything? Yeah, case in point. Fuck me. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I saw that one on Twitter. Okay. Fairy stone's definitely worth picking up. Stop there by again soon. Okay. Let's see. Oh, we still need to track down this fucking dude. We could go to Har Village if we wanted to. Occupy the dwelling, risen shadow. Huh. We could also just explore around here. Right? Can I talk to this guy? Hi. Got some coin to spare your humble storyteller. Much yeah. appreciated. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. Huh. I don't tell of him. So where's he get his coin then? Makes a man wonder it does. Could be he's involved in. Hmm. Okay, I mean, I just gave him a hundred. Okay, yeah, let's let's have a look around this area, the common quarter. Some interesting tidings about town. Oh, really? If you refer to changes in the military's makeup, oh. I've heard the same. Indeed. 
tell is, there's been a shift in the chain of command. With regards to Sir Brandt, or is he not military? Is he more like domestic guards or something? Right. If he, does captain of the guard count as military? I don't think so. But maybe. Oh, hey! It's you! The sight of Yonok's cart has brought all my fatigue to... You say you're on the hunt for Grifentia. Darren asked that of you, I expect. To said a woefully lost blacksmith once stumbled into the arbor... Yeah, look, he just started blushing. ...with us upon parting. In your language, it is called by another name. What was it? I know I've read of it. Of course. Scale Cinder. That's the one. It can be found in Batal, I believe. I know no more than that. It isn't much talked about, you see. The blacksmith was a dwarf, and the elders are rather prejudiced about their ilk. Uh, dwarves and elves, they just can't seem to get along. Okay. Good. Did he do, like, a wistful longing emote at me? Okay. Can we just get all manner of people just, like, horny for us? Honestly, I'd be down for that. Heard of any ways to make some easy coin? No? Shame. Alright, let's peek out here. Huh. What of these guards? Can't you see I'm on duty? I have a pressing duty to which I must attend. Okay. Tell is, the nobles are all in a flurry ingratiating themselves with the sovereign. That's why they've been holding all these fancy masquerades, see? They're supposed to lift his spirits or some such. I've got to wonder what comfort ale and dancing are to a man who's been charred to a crisp. <laughs> but I suppose I'm just jealous. Imagine having naught better to do than drink and revel the night away. All right. I mean, sure enough, but look at you, dude. You got quite the spread here. For just one guy. Okay. Over this way. Oh. Hey. What's up with you? Heard about this... This beggar guy? No. Okay. Let's head on back out. This building? Second floor here. I think we did some platforming in this building. Or above it. On top of it. Huh. Yeah, I know not. There's Mildred's again. Oh, look. There's something out here. A place to call one's own is no small fortune. I should like such an abode myself. Say, when next we meet, will you tell me about all the sights you have seen on your travels? I do so enjoy hearing about them. In the meantime, I shall leave you with this, in the hope that twill be of some use to you. A fairy stone. Sven. Forgive me for stopping by unannounced. I was so eager to see you. I neglected to think of your convenience, and lo and behold, you're out. At least, I remember to bring you a gift in recompense. I shall leave it here. I only hope we will see each other again anon, for I long to hear more of your tales about the world, your life, and your experiences. I don't know. In this in this case, they seem fairly platonic. Right? Let's see. Huh. Uh, the fruit wine is probably another gift we can... Yeah, we can, like, re-gift it. Alright. Good. Yeah, I need to remember about this place. about down here? Anything of interest? We go in here? I don't remember. It's all becoming a bit of a blur. There's this other tavern outside of... Well, not outside of town, but kind of on the outskirts. 
Oh, it is locked up. Huh. I can't get up there. Oh, shit. Huh. Do I have a good way up there? I don't know that I do. Hello. Make it quick. I ain't got all day. What's up with you? Can't say I have any tidings to share. Okay, Katarina. Okay, yeah, let's go out here and check out this... This tavern. Been curious about this for some time. Oh, this is a slums. Hello. What to do? What to do? I have no mother or father to speak of, you see. So the nice people at the Gracious Hand take care of me. I wanted to get them a present to say thank you, and I thought a bunch of flowers would be just the thing. Oh, I've I've got some. You could have. The problem is, I can't seem to find any good ones. Listen, I found some really good ones. Do you think you could help me? All I need is a bunch of pretty flowers. Yeah. For true. For true. Thank you ever so much, Arisen. I'm sure you'll find the prettiest flowers that ever were. Yeah, Hoy here you go. Arisen, have you brought me a bunch of flowers already? Yeah, there you go. Oh, just look at them. They're the most beautiful flowers I've ever seen. <laughs> These should brighten the sisters' days. Say, would you mind terribly if I asked you another favor? Uh-oh. Um, ask away. See, one of my friends taught me a magic spell. It's supposed to let you meet whomever you like. What? All you have to do is find a silver stone, put it under your pillow, and say the magic words. But there's the problem. I've been looking all over for such a stone. And I can't find one anywhere. Would you find a silver stone and bring it to me, Arisen? You talking about a fairy stone? No, I think those are like bluish, aren't they? For true. I knew I could count on you, Arisen. I'll be waiting. Our next mission oh, some is to silver acquire a ore. silver stone. Mayhap silver ore will serve. We can purchase it or mine it up ourselves. Okay. Yeah, well, our That's house is right over here. Thinking. We've definitely got plenty of silver. Well, okay, not our house, but <laughs> the house we've been living in. Okay, up here. Oh, look at this. Where the hell am I going now? Whoa. Yeah, where the hell am I going? Oh, shit. This place. Is that Wakestone? Wakestone Shard. Good enough. Oh, I can't enter here. Okay. Nonetheless, here's Mildred so we can take some silver ore out. Let's see here. Silver ore. Gotcha. Let's make that a priority. Wasn't that all we had to deliver hey, to someone? I know you. What do you think? Does this suit me? What? What? Your outfit? I expect this <laughs> I don't know. Will suffice That's all you ever wear. Stone Miss Daphne requested. Let us deliver it to her now. All right. Let's do that. Follow me, master, if you would. Oh, sorry. I'll bring you to the one you seek. Oh, I think I know. Well, now, isn't this yeah. lucky? Someone who knows the way. Hey, Daphne. Oh, I can't find a silver stone anywhere. Have you fared any better? I have. Here's a silver stone for you. An ore found in abundance among the mountains and crags of Vermont's hinterlands can be used to enhance equipment. So this doesn't... Silver ore doesn't occur in Batal? I wonder what they have. Oh, just look how it shines. Thank you ever so much. Say, aren't you curious who I want to meet? 
I'm, I wasn't really, but maybe now that you mention it. Well, I'll tell you. My mother and father. Oh. I don't even know what they look like, you know. Right. Not to say I'm unhappy at the gracious hand, of course. Yeah. But I'd really like to meet them. Even just once. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. Fuck. I'm sorry, kid. I want to tell them how grateful I am that they gave me life. Oh, it's so shiny. Oh. Hi, Arisen. You'll help me again if I need it, won't you? Please say yes. Okay, I, I will. Do you need help right Ms. now? Miss Daphne seemed pleased with our efforts. Mayhap we ought to pay her another visit sometime soon. Okay, return in a few days' time. Sure. Hey, what's up with you two? Is it true you're the Arisen? I am. Only, I seem to recall someone else boasting of being the Arisen over in the tavern about six months ago. In the tavern? Just be sure you play your part well, whatever the truth. The fellow Drake or two, and I reckon you'll learn the people's faith. <laughs> Good luck to you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> He's so chipper. Say, I've noticed you walking around questioning people. Looking for information, are we? Yeah. If I were you, I'd pay a visit to the jail next, if you haven't already. I have not. The place is full of unsavory characters, as one might expect who've seen things ordinary citizens aren't privy to. Oh. I should know. I was among their company till just recently. Oh. Good to, good to know. Will this take long? I've ought to be doing. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just making the rounds. Oh, look at you. Holy hell, look at this little animation. Oh my gosh. That was in there? Oh, no, wait, it was, it was this pile next to it. Oh, careful. You're gonna hit that person in- Ooh! Oh my gosh. It's like a Three Stooges bit ready to happen. What's up with you? For the roads, the heavier my pockets. Oh. What do you want? Okay. What have we here? Letter fragment. Of the gracious hand, do say you'll go and see her. She's your best hope. She used to conduct research into sedatives and sleeping medicants for the army o'er in Batal, so I'm certain she will. Huh. Wish I had someone to talk to. Sets my thoughts down dark Okay. Who are you? You best watch yourself. I always am. <laughs> it's a third person game. <laughs> now look. Is there aught over here? Oh, shit. That's really high up, actually. Okay. Oh, what's this? Secret jail exit? I would appreciate your swift return, master. Oh, A yeah. A unease begins to gnaw at me when you are gone over long. Well, can I somehow reach can that? do is wait. Huh. Gordon, can you... What manner of madness is this? <laughs> Sorry, Gordon. I need to check if there's anything up there. Go, Gordon. My nose tells me there's aught close by. I'll have a look. Yeah, check Keep it out, your Gordon. Ears pricked all the same. Our foes might well use this chance to sneak up on us. Go, Gordon. Go. Follow your nose. Follow your nose, Gordon. Follow your nose. Yes. Follow your nose, Gordon. Follow your nose. The nose knows. What the hell, Gordon? Do I need to get closer? What the fuck? <laughs> Damn you to hell, Gordon. <laughs> okay. Well, let's check over here more. They're a useful it suppose you're all right. Oh, thanks, Curtis. There's beast skin out here? Rotten scrag. A little fucked up to be taking stuff from the slums abodes, but well. Pray grant those less fortunate some salvation. <gasps> salvation. For those unawares, uh, Salvation was a great uh, clandestine enemy faction in the first game. 
Also, Gordon just completely robbed this, like, I don't know, charitable place of its of its herbage. Well, hey. that, sir, uh, arisen. Might I trouble you for arms? <laughs> it's Kendrick. For the poor. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, Kendrick. Of, of course. Of course. Give food. Give a donation of coin. I'll do a bit of both. Here, have a fresh fish. Many thanks. May fortune smile upon you, kind sir. Okay. Well met, sir Arisen. Might I trouble you for alms for the poor? Yeah, here, have, have some money. A thousand G's. Many sure. thanks. May fortune smile upon you, kind sir. Ah, hold on a moment, sir Arisen. Perchance oh. you would be willing to aid me with another matter. Oh, like what? You see, one of the children we care for here at the gracious hand has gone missing. Oh my god, what? Malcolm, his name is. He's a steady lad. I can't imagine he would have run away. This building's very old. It could be that he's found himself in some strange corner of it. What? Might I impose on you to search for him? He's in a strange corner? Gathering clues will be essential to our success in this matter. What the hell say. are you talking about? You don't know your own building? There's what some poor kid in here? Some information. I can guide you to the vicinity of our destination, Master. <clears throat> oh, okay. Oh, you can guide us. Okay, lead the way, Amethyst. Follow me if you would. I would. I know the path best traveled. Well, now, isn't this lucky? Someone who knows the way. Go, Amethyst. Lead the way. Oh, is this the kid? Malcolm's been really into oh. exploring of late. Just the other day, he was going around telling anyone who'd listen about how he was an ox hair away from making some big discovery. Huh. Okay. Well, that isn't as helpful as I would have hoped. Chaos in the world begins with chaos of the mind. What? That is a wild thing to just say. My greens are second to none. Are the were these your I greens? I spend my days in quiet reflection. Good day, sir. Of course, are you leading me somewhere too? No. Maybe around back. Is there a little secret cave down here? No. Worth a shot. Materials such as this can be combined to craft things. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Okay, over here. Hmm. I'll carefully conserve oh, my strength upon. and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defensive tactics. Well, that's that's good to know, but I'm not looking for any of that for for now. Okay, can I talk to I you again? I wonder what it was Malcolm found. Treasure? I wonder what it was. Hmm. Maybe we should talk to all the kids. Are you a kid? I'm quite sure I wasn't dreaming, but ox carts don't run so late at night. Was it a phantom then? I shudder to think. I fear I'll make for poor conversation. Okay. I don't think you're a kid. Hi, I'm well enough, thank you. Over here? What do you want? Hey, do you know us as well? Here, at least in Vermont, or Vernsworth? The slums have a significantly higher Beastron population, right? These writings could be of import. Let's have a look then. Oh, what writings? What have you seen, Gordon? The sun's too bright for these poor eyes. Oh, over here I see. I'm dead on my feet. But I've much to do yet. Oh, you mean these writings? Oh. Was that crucial for us? I don't uh, feel no, I don't think so. This place now fails to calm my spirit. 
Look, is it this? Can we get in here? This strange tower? Huh. Is there a way I can get up there? Maybe I can jump from the top of this building. Yeah, look. Can I jump this? No, I have to go around. Master, my heart knows no greater peace than when I'm by your side. Okay. Yeah, this is it. We gotta go into this. Ugh. Shit, shit, shit. Oh. That's it, though, huh? That's gotta be it. Okay. Here goes nothing. Oh, wait. How might I get in then? Never mind. I know not. Do I break this? Oh. Uh oh. Have we have we upset everyone? Uh oh. Oh shit. The nuns are jumping. Okay. Hey. Might I beg but a moment of your time? Oh, yeah, what's up? Might I beg but a moment? I mean, you can. You can if you like. I don't mind. Oh, down here, there's a little secret under area. Okay. Are there zombies in here? What was that? Is that someone sleeping real weird? Is that a really weird form of snoring? Or is there like a fucking zombie? Uh-oh. Dude, there are zombies in here, huh? Listen to that. Can I shoot this door down? No. There's no way that's... What's a patient, man? What the fuck? You best watch yourself. Huh. Maybe it's the kid? Like, thirsty or whatever? Thirsty and starving? Like, I could imagine someone who's like, Oh, I need some water. Right? You kind of sound like a zombie then. If you're really thirsty. Okay. Is that person peeing? No. Malcolm. All he's doing of late is picking through rubble. Don't know why he bothered. Maybe he was hoping to find something shiny among the rubble. Wonder if he found anything good. Okay. Down here? There is some rubble down here. True enough. I'll get that for you. Can't say I have any tidings to share. Hmm. Okay. Oh, this is where we jumped down before. Gotcha. Well, look, here's plenty of rubble to pick through. If Malcolm is here. I feel like that raspy, gaspy noise is integral to what we're looking for. Nice little bridge. You'll pass me by. Just like all the rest. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I pass a lot of people by though. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. No harm in picking Waller's Walter's Tavern. Eh, nothing in here. Don't like this place at all. We've already left the Sphere of influence that we need be searching. 
Huh. This is not good. Where could Malcolm have gotten off to? Perhaps you could try asking the other children. I haven't been able to get much out of them myself. Where could perhaps you could okay. try asking? Yeah, I feel like I've talked to all the kids though. Maybe not. Okay. Yeah, I spoke with you. Their kids back here. Anything's better than this. Even the I feel like picking through rubble and whatnot red, was was a big hint, because we had seen that rubble, you know, by the the tower there. Huh. Can I now interact with the rubble? Maybe. Now that I have that hint, like this looks like a crawl space, you know. Okay. Otherwise, I see no other way in. Like, it seems to look like there is a an entry point here. But I climb on top and there's no way to, to do it. Right? Unless there is now? Now that I've talked to that one kid about the rubble? Yeah, there's aught. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Is there anyone else I should ask? Is this person a child? Farming might look like simple work, no. but tisn't. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing linking underground here. I need our lantern on now. Are you a kid? I can't even talk to you. The heavens have forsaken us. All is lost. There's a car. Huh. Yeah, Some rubble here. My thoughts down dark paths this place. For once, when we need help finding something, our pawns are are silent. Still a while to go before me shifts over. There's not like a way I can shoot something at that tower and open it up, huh? Sets my thoughts down dark paths. I don't like this place at all. Huh. It's been a hard day. Was I lacking in devotion? There's people stood out here now. You don't need a permit to get into Batal. Just hide in the back of an optic right. mind. Yep. But it's easy enough. I should know. I've yeah, yeah. Hmm. Do you know? Oh, so shiny. No. What about you? Is is Malcolm all right? Oh, I haven't spoken with you. We were supposed to go exploring together, but I overslept, and he went without me. Wish he'd woken me up. I was really looking forward to going down into those vaults. Oh. Oh no, I wasn't meant to tell anyone that. We'd best report back. Ah, uh, okay. There we are. Where has Kendrick gone then? Oh, he may be in there. Places such as this ought to be protected. Let's see. Any of you all Kendrick? Think not. Kendrick, you down here? In here? Oh, that's the weird zombie inside the wall. What a scary fucking place, huh? Wickedness has no hold on a Nobody mentioned the weird, like, zombie noises from the basement. Okay, Kendrick, where are you going? Oh, here you are. Fantastic. Vaults, you say? 
By my knowledge, they were sealed off. Ah, but you mentioned rubble, aye? Then perhaps the lad found a way through. Ah, uh, perhaps. Come, I fear there's not a moment to lose. Pray, follow me, and quickly. I believe this is the place I fucking to which knew it. I fucking knew it. Look there, a hole. Could he have passed through here? Yeah, I bet I could. There is naught to be done but have a look for ourselves. The passage ahead looks small, but we may be able to squeeze yeah, through. Yeah, definitely me. Let us make haste. I'm just a little guy. Jesus, I don't think we squeezed. God, did we try to send Gordon first or what? I was told of the vaults, but ne'er did I dream that the gracious hand sat atop catacombs such as these. There may be monsters about. We'd best be on our guard. Oh, Malcolm, I pray you are unharmed. Oh, Malcolm, I... Oh, wait, what was that? Oh, Malcolm, I pray you are unharmed. Come, we must hurry. Okay. Vaults? Wow, does this one have, like, a weird fucked-up experiment or something? Nought feels quite so wasteful as coming upon a fine piece of equipment after purchasing the very same item in a shop. True enough, Gordon. Good thing that hasn't happened quite yet. Look at this. A million rats down here. Can I take a rat? Lucky us. That's worth taking. It's locked up. I don't think I can pick up rats. Sadly. Okay. Dang. Can I make that jump? <laughs> yep. Oh my god! Old man Kendrick can, too. He's quite limber for his age. Okay. Granted, so can Gordon. Right. I guess more so, Kendrick doesn't look the type. Jesus. Quite the catacombs. Oh. Thank goodness you are unharmed. You have my eternal gratitude, Sir Arisen. Now I can breathe freely at last. Sir Kendrick? You'll never believe what I've found. I thought he was going to say more. Ahead. <laughs> my bad. Books, sir. Books, books, and more books. It's like some sort of secret workshop. What? Truly. Perhaps we ought to take a look. Okay. We ought to not lose sight of our guide. Yeah, we also probably... I, <laughs> I could have just gone ahead rather than the kid having to go into a potential zom zombie zone. But, uh, okay. We'll do it. You're the expert of caring for children, Kendrick. Let my magics grant you an elemental boon. Heavens above! Isn't it amazing? And I found it. Me. Why is he so scared? It's quite a find indeed. Is this some manner of archive? Oh. Okay. Why, I've never seen so many books. This collection must be worth a fortune. It is a veritable treasure trove of wisdom. Is this like old Beastrin stuff? Did this also used to be like a Beastrin capital city and they just built on top of it? Might I ask that you not share the existence of this place with others, Sir Arisen? We okay. cannot allow the knowledge accumulated here to be misused or mistreated. We ought to entrust its care to someone worthy, someone who can appreciate its true value. Pray, tell me if you know of such an individual. God, I, I don't. As for you, Malcolm, I forbid you from telling anyone else about this place. It will be our little secret. Understood? Okay, yeah, he's... <laughs> you're, gonna, you're gonna have this kid try and keep this secret? Okay. Oh, but... However, in exchange for your silence, you may come and go as you please. 
I wouldn't... I would not do that. Let's investigate this place's secrets together, eh? It near boggles the mind that so impressive an archive slumbered here. Tis surely any scholar's dream. Let's see you, this Malcolm. This place is amazing. I knew I'd find something down here, but I never expected this. This place is a... Kendrick, what about you? Oh, I can't wait to find... The books ne'er seem to end. Who could have brought them here, I wonder? All right, everyone to me. I wonder if this is going to link up to that weird creepy area. Sundress, Concord, a lot of spell tomes I'm guessing will be in here. One right here must be important. A historic account, chapter three. In spite of these differences, the two nations have managed to coexist largely peacefully. Huh. Perhaps realizing the futility of an all-out war between two neighbors, though there have been several examples of one side instigating an invasion, always some greater power has intervened before the balance could be tipped too far in the favor of either nation, preventing the fires of war from escalating into an inferno. Sure, but there was a war, right? So that dates that book. I think this is it for me. What? Oh gosh. Oh, there's a spider. Steadfast there, Malcolm. It was just a sizable spider. He just senses. If all this place is okay, igneous melody. Hmm. Wonder if there's anything on top of these shelves. Another book here. A historic account, chapter four. Tensions twixt Vermund and Batal reached their peak forty years ago when both nations were devastated by a prolonged bout of bad weather that resulted in successive crop failures. Hard times turned the starving, starving populaces against one another, eventually culminating in a desperate clash of several hundred soldiers, though it produced no victors, resulting in only more meaningless deaths. Upon the site of this battle now sta stands a cenotaph, a cenotaph, in memory of the fallen. Huh. Okay. I don't think we've seen such a thing yet. Okay. Oh, I can't climb this. I guess that means there's nothing up there, then. It seems like all of the important ones that we could read had a conveniently lit candle near them. Okay. So let's proceed deeper then. Ooh. There's a fun-loving rat. Okay. Hmm. I suppose we need... Or no, wait. What was that quest? The Arisen Shadow? Oh, no, wait. Okay, never mind. Huh. Oh, did they leave? They must have. Okay, sure. I was about to say, I wonder if this was linked to... We shall have to crane on next to spot our foes in a place like this. ...to the main Keep quest. Your eyes peeled. I don't think so, though. At last. Seeker's token. I thought we'd never find one. A splendid discovery. Interesting. 
I shall have to inform my own master of this. There we go. Smash these up. Still some other parts of these, like, underworks here that we haven't been to. Right, there's one chamber over this way. Got a treasure here. Ring of Conservation. Got that open. Let's see, what does this ring do? Magic defense. Eh. Perhaps useful if we fight like a really difficult enemy. Lots of bats. Probably best that Kendrick and Malcolm cleared out. Really looking like there's gonna be undead. Jagged bones, stability extract. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. More stuff to sift through. Okay. You'll not live to regret this. I will say, I'm very glad that it's like a weird book vault slash sarcophagus or <laughs> mausoleum rather than sewers. Right. What the fuck are we listening to? Okay. Oh. Dead end down here. Guess we're going up. <laughs> what the fuck happened to her? Did the rat hit her? Did we lose one of our... Oh my gosh, yeah. Our other... Pawn is gone. Thank you. What the hell happened to them? You'll pull through. Okay. Oh, this is this back is where we you, were. Master. I thought it might come in useful. Right, yeah, if we hadn't made the jump, we would have needed to go down through all this. Battle is upon us. Okay. Search up here. Oh, is this once more the book vault, yeah. Okay. Sure. Oh. Head on back down. Having a difficult time keeping track of where we have and have not been here. How about here? We gone through this? Right? Yeah, we just went through here. I think. Yeah. Okay. I wonder what happened to that other pawn. Huh. They were a thief, so I don't know. Maybe it's fine. Let me think on this a moment. What should I do? Oh? What business would you have with a humble farmer? Oh, I'm I don't know. I thought you had some business here. What are you thinking about? What to do? What to do? Oh, Daphne Oi, again. Risen. Say, have you heard about the state of the river? The river? Do you know the river close by the church? Well, it's come to be full of muck and filth and all sorts. How's that? That's a problem for the church, as it draws from the river to make holy water. The water's so filthy that it's going to take twice the amount of gold ore to purify it. Gold ore? You purify it with gold? I was thinking you could help the priests by finding some gold ore. After all, it wouldn't be good for anyone if the church ran out of holy water. They make holy water with gold? Okay. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Thanks ever so much. I'll help too. I'll look for gold No, ore no, it, that's okay. Can... No, you don't need to do that. Now, You're going to fall down that ore. fucking weird Those place. Those shops... 
mining some ourselves might prove a better choice. Okay, we need two pieces of just it. Kendrick. I pray this will convey the depth of my gratitude. Oh, for finding the kid? Logistician's Tome. Oh, fuck. Specialization Logistician. Enables the pawn to lighten the Arisen's load by moving items between allies' packs as they f see fit. Also enables the pawn to combine materials into the inventory on their own initiative. Okay. Yeah, that seems a good one. Pray, keep your voice low. Oh, okay. Hey, Malcolm. Isn't this your home? Oh, whoops. What did he say? <laughs> Fuck, we got Forager one now, too. Enables the pawn to mark the locations of enhancement materials, materials used to enhance equipment on the map. Okay, well, Gordon kind of just looks for everything anyway, right? And, and also, honestly, between myself and Gordon, uh, I think we're, we're going to be just fine, right? We, we find everything. Also, notice here, the dude in these pictures... This is, um, this is the protagonist from the first game, right? It's got his, like, shaggy, long, medium-length hair. And he's a fighter. I think his name is Varmond or something now. In this game. At least the, the version of him that we saw from the very beginning, who is a choosable character. Okay, before we end this video, let's go and get, um... Let's go and get our our stuff from Mildred's. Get that gold. Okay. Oh, someone left us some shit. Brant. Had I not encountered your majesty when I did, I fear this nation would have been led down a false path. My gratitude to you, and to whatever power orchestrated our fortuitous meeting, knows no bounds. I believe you are more than worthy of this token of my esteem, and I pray it will be of aid to you on the long road ahead. Steeled virtue? What is that? Looks like a one-handed sword. Yeah. Okay. A blade permitted only to the to high-ranking members in the Varmundian army. Gordon, would you care for that? You would. Well, enjoy it, my friend. Okay. Deposit this. A tome that grants a pawn the logistician specialization, allowing them to combine materials and move items between allies' packs as they see fit. I mean, I feel like that's a really useful one for me to have. Right, because it'll keep our carry weight kind of evened out. Okay. Give to Gordon. Oh, Gordon's too far. Well, I guess we can deposit some of this other shit. There we are. Do I have anything as well? Oh, wait, this is not me. Okay. Seems fine now. All right, let's give this to Gordon. Use it. Gordon acquired the Logistician Specialization. Lovely. So now Gordon will just automatically sort around our inventory a bit? And balance out our encumbrance, maybe? We've seen some pawns do it and combine stuff. But I don't think I've really seen them move stuff. You know? Okay. Oh, right. We need gold. My bad. Tend to this real fast. With 
draw. Oh my gosh, look at all the savagery extract we're carrying around. Oh, we're... My bad. I'm withdrawing. <laughs> what a fool I am. Okay. We need two pieces of that. Then deposit. Okay. Good. Got the gold. Let's head back to try and find Daphne real quick. Oh god, how do we get there? Oh, through this area? Oh gosh, oh, I thought that fucking beastron was a zombie. Okay. Yeah, we still don't know about the weird zombie shit that <laughs> sounds like it exists in the basement. That's a little fucking weird, huh? Have you found any gold ore yet? I have. There you are. Wow! This'll be plenty, I reckon. Thank you ever so much. Listen, I was talking to the priests, and apparently our troubles aren't over yet. Would you be willing to lend us a hand again, Arisen? Just one more time. Okay, what is it this time? Thanks. So, remember how I told you about the river by the church getting all mucky? Well, the grown-ups are saying it's gotten worse. Now lots of people who live nearby are falling sick. Oh, God. The priests have been treating everyone as best they can, but there's nowhere near enough medicine to go round. Oh, uh, you need some salubrious drafts? I want to help them, but I'm not sure what I can do. Apart from ask you, that is. Would you bring us some more medicine, Arisen? Yeah. Oh, thanks, Arisen. What would we do without you? Or maybe blight cures? I'll talk to the priests in the meantime. See if there's anything useful I can do. Now with need of medicine, we can purchase it at shops. Or make some ourselves by combining the ingredients. Medicine for treating blight. Do I have it? No. Okay. Well, we'll do this real quick. One last request. Why not? Let's see. Oh, we need to go up. There we are. Okay. Oops. We need to withdraw. And it was like purple, right? Yeah. Okay, that should do it. There we are. You know what? Maybe we already had it. Doesn't seem like our marker changed or updated or anything. Hoi, you risen! Have you brought any medicine with you? Yep, here you go. Oh, fuck. Oh, we need... We need a fucking lot of it. Okay, we need five. Not yet. Fair enough. Come find me when you have some. Okay. Yeah, hang on. I got, I got plenty. Okay. Good. Fortunately, we just have infinite sprints, too. So we'll just get four more out of here. I'd rather not give away my panacea. There we are. Perfect. Okay, let's head on back. Quite the fetch quest, though. I'm curious what, if anything, we'll get from this. Hey, Arisen. Have you brought any medicine with you? I have. There you go. Now that's just splendid. Oh, thank you, Arisen. This should be plenty. I'll take it to the church straight away. 
Tis a goodly deed. Oh, a golden trove beetle. The sick. I only hope our efforts go a ways toward improving life in the slums. You have my support. Okay. Do you have anything else to say? Thanks, sir. Thanks, sir. Oh, all right. Fair enough. Places such as this ought to be. Perhaps you've a moment to spare, an ear to lend. Okay, not really though. Just kidding. <laughs> Got any good stories to share? All right. I wonder if we got everything done here. A moment's prayer can do a world of good. I think maybe we have. All right. Lovely. Well, let's head on back to our little humble abode. Okay. Pray slow your feet. Oops, sorry, Gordon. You run too fast for the likes of me. Let us endeavor to keep up, though we are less fleet of foot. Yeah, not much in the way of uh, fighting and killing, but uh, still, a bunch of adventures nonetheless this time. I suppose, when next we come back, we've got plenty more for Sir Brant. We could always try and track down that beggar somehow, I don't know. Uh, we could, we are missing a pawn, we could get another support pawn in our tow and make sure we track that quest and make sure we sift through... The available pawns and sort by pawns that know the quests that we're on and maybe they'll be able to help us right we could try that all right until next time please take care of each other <laughs>